The Nobel Assembly at Karolinska Institutet has today decided to award the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine for 2006 jointly to Andrew Fire and Craig Mello for their discovery of RNA interference. Big news for two American researchers, 45-year-old Craig Mello of the University of Massachusetts Medical School and 47-year-old Andrew Fire, Stanford University, are the newest Nobel winners. They discovered a way to turn off the effect of specific genes, which could lead to new ways to fight AIDS or cancer, and helps defend against viral infection. I think a lot of us here are thinking about um, making contributions from basic scientists to medicine in the next few years as being able to help physicians guide treatment by understanding more about disease. Mello almost didn't answer the telephone at 4.40 Monday morning. And I came back to the bed and the phone rang again and my wife said, it's a crank call, don't pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I said, but they're announcing the Nobel Prize. <laughs> I said I'd better pick it up. <laughs> the Nobel Prize is a centuries-old honor, one of the most prestigious awards worldwide, honoring outstanding work in five categories. Alfred Nobel established the prizes in his will in 1896. For Mello, there is no time to rest. He wants to get back to work. My most uh, deepest hope is that this will lead to uh, therapeutics that will help people. Um, I think that that is going to happen. I hope it will happen uh, soon. I think what, that we're losing time right now because we're not spending enough money to do the basic research that will lay the foundation for great new drugs. Mello and Fire will split a $1.4 million prize and meet Scandinavian royalty at a banquet in December. Nancy Lyons, The Associated Press.